It's September 2021 and this month we've passed the 500 video mark on the Fretboard Atlas. Here's what's been happening this past month and what's coming up next. Firstly, to mark the achievement of 500 videos on the channel, I'm going to be uploading a rundown of every single video that I've put up on the channel so far. This will be available to watch for free both here on the channel and on YouTube. In the under the hood section, I'm going to show you how to use a loop pedal from scratch. I'm also going to show you how I use it as a practice tool and sometimes as a compositional tool as well. And speaking of composition, last month we covered the second section of the series on composing music, titled Expanding Your Musical Ideas. This coming month we're going to be looking at the third section, which is called Varying Your Compositional Ideas, or in simple language, what to do if your compositions all sound the same. In the All Things Guitar section we started looking at fingerpicking etudes. Etudes are short pieces of music that can help you to hone in and develop a particular skill or technique. We looked at a piece called Light Fingered, which has some walking bass lines, some rolling open string melodic lines, some jazzy chords, and it's a great piece to practice your fretting hand accuracy. This month, by request, we're going to start looking at the most common chord progressions in music, because if you get comfortable with the most common chord progressions, if you can identify them and play along with them, you'll be able to play with any musician at any point, any time. In the Shane's original section, we looked at my tune Dance Tonight, which is my Nile Rodgers infused disco fingerstyle piece. Unfortunately, we didn't get a look in at my tune The Peacock Strut, so we're going to do that this month instead, along with my tune Grove Road, which is a great flat picking tune. In the interviews and extra section, we heard from Canadian acoustic guitar legend Don Ross, and this coming month, we're going to be hearing from my good friend, Danish guitar player Casper Esman, all about his musical practice. In the traditional Irish music section, last month we looked at the famous waltz Thor Thumb the Love, as well as a really well known slip jig called The Rocky Road to Dublin. This month we're going to be looking at more Irish tunes in the same way. I'm really looking forward to this month on the Fretboard Atlas. Thank you as always for being part of the journey. If there's a topic you want to cover, please let me know and I will cover it on the channel. And if you're ready to learn some more, get your guitar and let's dive in.